This Costa Rican fishing adventure is brought to you by Pen Tackle. Let the battle begin. Hey, it's day two here at Costa Rica at the Crocodile Bay Resort. Uh, we have high expectations today for a great day of fishing. Today we're out with Mike Rice. Mike is the pretty much runs Pen and you know knows everything about the product. He's an excellent fisherman, been out with him before, and above that, he's a great friend. Let's see what we can do. Today's weather was the opposite of yesterday. Clear skies and light winds. Our first fish of the day was on the Magic Swimmer. Actually, Patrick Sabeel is down here with us, uh, the designer of all these lures. The action on this lure is very snake-like. It's a, joint, a triple jointed lure. The fish here are very, very fast and you have to rip this, these lures through the water pretty much as fast as you can crank them or at least near that. Uh, when I caught this fish, it, um, it, it exploded on the Magic Swimmer. We used an all white Magic Swimmer and uh, Jack Crevel fight hard, uh, you know, about as hard as any fish per pound. We continue to work the Pacific facing beach to no avail. Yesterday's action happened later in the tide, so we were still confident we would catch a rooster. Then the lunch bell rang, and Mike Rice was hooked up. That was about the weirdest bite I've seen in a while, but it's a rooster. It's a decent rooster, and he's taking it on. Yeah, rooster. Rooster's a pretty cool fish, actually. They're they're basically a jack, but they're they're much more glorified than a jack is. You know, a jack Creval or amberjack doesn't get a lot of glory yeah, back in the states, yeah. but right. Costa Rica. I mean, a rooster fish right. is a nice big jack, and they're they're probably the hardest fighting fish in in the ocean, in my opinion. Shortly after, it was Mike Caruso's turn. This was his first rooster. I finally got my rooster fish, and I was stoked. Um, these fish not only fight hard, but they're probably one of the most exotic looking fish you can catch, no matter where you go in the world. Tail? Uh, right absolutely tail, right? loved it. it. It fought hard and, uh, you know, put a smile on my face, but I think everybody else on the boat as well. Look at the beautiful fin on that fish. Fights like an Abrams tank. I mean, the thing just plows through the water. In the mix were some nice jacks too. The bite was on and Mike Rice was hooked up again with a nice pompano. Yeah, we were, we were having a hard time getting a bite on the lure, so we, uh, we, we bridled up some very small goggle eyes. We didn't have a lot of herring and uh, put them back. Of course, I had the, we, we, had, we were running a little bit short on rods. I threw the lightest rod, put the lightest rod back. Of course, uh, we had about a 20 pound, 15, 20 pound pompano hit on the lightest rod. Uh, and and when you, if you know how they fight, they're a very uh, awkward fish, but they just like to get sideways and pinwheel and, and a really good fight. It was on a little 4,000 size class, so really good fight, 20 pound braid, really light. Mike Rice is the director of Penn and is the brainchild behind the new rods and reels. And pens come a long way in six years. We've been really focusing on getting our spinning reel line up, uh, up to par. And uh, we're down here fishing the Clash reels. That's our new premium spinning reel, high technology, machine cut gears. We've got one of our best drag systems in there, sealed clutch, really nice sealed ball bearing. So a really nice saltwater, uh, heavy duty reel, but extremely lightweight. And we, when you're holding the reels all day, that lightweight really comes into play. So, so the rods we were fishing them on, we had them matched up with Battalion Inshore and Carnage 2. The Carnage 2 is a new launch for us this year. Uh, it's really a boat rod. We've got jigging rods, we've got boat rods, we've got uh, plug-in rods, we've got ca casting rods, we've got a very full assortment. Uh, today we were using some of the longer seven foot and seven and a half foot rods to throw the bigger poppers, the magic swimmers, uh, the big stick shads, but a uh, really nice combination with the Clash, really lightweight. The day started slow, but ended red hot. Tim C. Smith for thefisherman.com. This Costa Rican fishing adventure is brought to you by Pen Tackle. Let the battle begin. <laughs>